Good evening. It is 7.38pm on Friday the 17th of January and it is time for, firstly, a mail opening. Because why not? You know, I've been a busy bee. First off, I'm actually going to show you something else. I made this. This is to basically help me quickly with my planning. So on this side, you have columns going across the page. Um, so one column is 26 squares, two columns is 13 squares, three columns is eight squares with a square left at either end, and so on and so forth, all, all the way down the doohickey. Then we have on this side, my rows. So you would look at it like this, but one row would obviously be a full page. Two rows would be, you know, 19 square. So for example, when I do my weekly setup, I can tell you that my um, boxes are 13 squares wide because it's half the page. And then they are nine deep. And I can fit four of those on a, um, where is it? There you go, four rows, nine squares. And also I could use this to help me. And yes, I do have two spare and they are usually left at the top of my page where my washi tape goes. So that's that anyway. So I've also got some mail to open. I've got no idea what any of this is. It's been sat here waiting for me to come along and open it. And I'm always reluctant to cut into their packaging because they're really very willy nilly about their packaging. So let's have a look what we've got. I'm pretty sure this is all AliExpress stuff. Oh good, I'm glad this has arrived. This is one of those little um, tear off weekly calendars and I wanted to um, use this. I've seen Mitts and who else is it? Job's Journals has done this as well. My knife is as blunt as anything. Um, and they, they tear off and they actually stick it in their book as part of sort of the decoration do you know what i mean which i and i just thought it looks it looks really cool i have to do it every single time but you know i thought i'd give it a try and this is basically what you get <laughs> you know i would have liked maybe if the numbers had been different colors especially at the weekends but that's good fun isn't it that'll do and then you just tear it off and add it into your journal i just quite like the idea of it so it wasn't too much. Right, let's have a look what's in here. Oh, I was very careful about how I cut that. I've got a good thing to do. Oh, yeah. This is some makeup I bought. I keep seeing this stuff advertised. I thought, I wonder if um, AliExpress do a version. Let's just cover that so you're not getting the glare. And what it is, is your, your makeup is like inside here. And you, you, this is your makeup spot and you squish it and then you rub it on. So I'm a bit like, oh my God, because I don't do foundation normally. So I'm, I'm going to experiment with that when I'm not on camera in case it's a really shit colour and doesn't suit me. And lastly, what have we got in here? Oh, well, I can tell you, this is washi tape. It's wide washi tape. Let's get it out of the Sodding thing. actually really really like that bag I'm 
and it's reusable. So I'm going to save it. So this is darker than it looked on the website, but it's quite a sort of floral type one. Twilight, it says. Oh, they're both twilight. Hmm. One's blue and one's brown. So we'll see. Right, so that's my goodies opened. I've got rubbish all over me. Okie dokie. Oh. I had a go when I did this. I had like quite a lot of space for of laminating, so I was sort of like, "Hmm, I wonder what else can I put in there." I had some daisies that I'd picked, and I thought, "I wonder if they'll laminate." Well, Sam's helpful hint number one: press your flowers <laughs> before you try laminating them, because otherwise that happens. I think it looks fascinating. I really do. I think it looks really good. But obviously, you know, this would have worked better if I had in fact pressed it. I was experimenting, so no great loss. Anyway, it is now 7.44 on Friday the 17th of January. And it's time for Today in My Brew Journal. When I moved my book to say, so how are you, are you alright? I hit my mouse and I stopped the recording. And I've just done two days worth of today in my boo journal and I wasn't fucking recording. I've literally been going through chatting away to you guys, not real and then all of a sudden my screen my computer screen went dark and I thought, well why has that gone dark? It's not supposed to do that when I'm recording. And I glanced down, I'm not fucking recording. <sighs> so you've seen nothing absolutely nothing fuck off youtube i don't care uh, that was yesterday this is today i was just about to pull a card i'm i am absolutely livid now livid beyond belief um I was apologising because I missed April's live because I fell asleep on the sofa last night. Um, yeah, and as I said, because you don't know, because I shall have to repeat everything that I said. Uh, my GP phoned me today and asked me how I was getting on, and I said, "Well, you know, still feel zonged out of it." Oh yeah, but how are you feeling? You know, how, how are your feelings? And I was like, "Well, I feel numb," you know. And all oh, right, well, I'll see how you go. See how you go, and you know, if you start to feel better up the dosage and I'm like for fuck's sake do you know I, I can't go I keep falling asleep and you're there going on about upping the fucking dosage I don't want to up the dosage I want to be able to function so I'm going to give this a few more weeks and if this still keeps happening I'm going to go back to him and go look this isn't working I keep falling asleep I can't do anything in the evenings I've got no me time at all because I put Daryl to bed and before you know he's still awake now it's eight o'clock and I'm dozing off every single night trying to watch Alex play Kingdom Hearts and I'm dozing off and that's that's I can't live like that I just can't live like that okay you've got the page of pentacles um you've got a choice in which direction you go now that could be um you know figuratively mentally emotionally or actually you know are you going on a trip or where do you want to go do you want to go here or do you want to go there um do you want to turn left or do you want to turn right you know um Do you want to wear a white top or a black top? Or, you know, sometimes the decisions are easy ones and sometimes they're really, really hard ones, you know. 
take that risk you know I mean here he is literally standing with a map and he is flipping a coin sometimes it is that easy to make that decision you are overthinking things by by dithering you know make the decision go take the step carried away I put you have a decision to make and you're overthinking things it really is as easy as tossing a coin I'm so cross that I turned off the recording stupid stupid mouse okay this is about the only thing that I haven't actually done so the 15th I was online with you guys yesterday yesterday was okay it was a day that I I went down, I saw Maggie, I did lots of walking, the dog went to the groomers and had a much needed haircut, she looks amazing, she's over there in her bed fast asleep, um, I walked a lot, I did some shopping, you know, all that kind of thing, so yeah, it, it was okay, but you know, I, I, I was in pain, and I'm in pain today, so I've had to have pain killer because I've been out walking again, yes, I've been out, I've been walking, and while everybody's like, oh, you've been out, yeah, but I've been out with my headphones on and not i'm not talking to anybody because <laughs> that is how i feel but you know i suppose it's a start whatever um why am i on that i need to be on that oh, i'm asleep now yes this says i was asleep from 9 46 but i slept for a little bit on the sofa but I don't, I don't do anything before sort of 8 o'clock in my thing. So from about there, I was awake for about an hour in the night. So I get to about there. Then I woke up about then. And I slept. Probably about as well as I did the night before. I've been shopping today and I bought a few bits and bobs, which I'm hoping to use in my journal. I don't know how much I recorded earlier, I don't know, you know. Uh, I have, oh, I'm just, oh, for God's sake, I give up. Right, I cleaned the loo. I've got a load in the laundry to dry. Uh, dishwasher is currently on. I've got to go out and scrub an oven. I bought my son a pizza as a surprise today. Cook from frozen, you put it on a tray, stick it in the oven. Bam, 15 minutes later, you've got a nice hot cooked pizza. It's wrecked my oven tray. It's stuck like fucking cornflakes, you know? I don't know whether you guys get cornflakes in the States. Um, but this stuff has stuck like dried porridge. It's dreadful. I can't get it off. I've scrubbed and scrubbed, so I've got the pan in to soak. And I've actually tweeted the company that makes the pizza because this is not the first time I've had this issue with this and said, you know, I bought this as a surprise for my son. 
we wrecked the pizza getting it off of the tray so he basically ended up eating a slop with a knife and fork and you couldn't pick it up and eat it because there was no base to it because the base is welded to my fucking oven tray i am absolutely freaking livid and i thought yeah i'll go in i'll do a video on i just contemplate alive for a moment there and then i was just like no because what i planned to do which is something else i said was i yesterday's challenge was chameleon now i've never drawn a chameleon so i was gonna shut off the video sketch it all in and then come back and, and show you the interesting bits really um i don't even know what today's challenge is <gasps> excuse me right so the words for the 16th and 17th are mindful and speech uh care about those who care and go where your efforts are appreciated. A shovel and a scarf. A chameleon and bananas. So I'm thinking I'm going to draw a chameleon on a banana tree or something. <laughs> um, yeah, so what I shall probably do is just shut off the... Um, oh, wrong one. No, that's not what I'm looking for either. I'm sorry, I'm trying to set up the races while talking to you guys. Um, Jolene and Kerry and Jolene wants a funny name. Hang on. Oh my god, it keeps literally jumping up and down every time I press it. Jolyn and Kerry. And, uh... Right. Um... Now I can't remember what I was saying. Yeah, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to sketch that up and then I will come back and we'll get on and I'm thinking I might actually do it with like a big double spread because I have no idea how to draw a chameleon. So I will be back in a little while once it's all sketched out.
Okay. <laughs> God, I lost letter and chicken there again. I nearly lost it there. <sighs> I should not letter when I'm close to the edge of the page. But I thought I was going to be able to fit that in. So I'm a bit annoyed there that I didn't. Never mind. So you have go where your efforts are appreciated. <laughs> um, care about those who care. Speech and mindful. And then I've got chameleon and some bananas. I'm going to do a little bit of journaling. Um, I'm hoping I can fit both days on here, but I don't know yet. Um, just have to wait and see. That's it, really. Um, yeah. <laughs> that's it uh, thank you so much for joining me today I hope you enjoyed this um, I'm sorry about the big gap of, of data where my stupid book landed on my thing and cut me off and I didn't even notice I'm so cross about that I'm like for crying out loud woman do you know what I mean it, 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 it. so yeah please feel free to give this video a thumbs up um, and don't forget the comments and the kisses for Daryl down below because you know he loves all of that. If you click the book here in the corner you will be subscribed and if you hit the bell that then appears somewhere down below you will be notified when I upload new content. If you have any comments, any questions, any suggestions, anything you want me to have a go at, please do leave it down below or send me a message privately. You can find all the details in my link tree link which is down there. Um, yeah, and that's pretty much it. So take it easy, have a fantastic rest of your day and I will be back on Sunday with today in my blue journal. Take it easy guys. <laughs>